Okay guys, just a quick one. Um, this is Seagate Backup Plus Hub. Um, I've got an iMac here, needs some extra backup on it to put big files on. Um, but you've only got four USB sockets, so I've got one hard drive plugged in already. I've got an SSD drive, the Mac's running off, plugged in. And I've got the audio interface plugged in. That only leaves me one USB socket, but this has a USB hub built in. So you plug it in and you get back your original socket, plus you get an additional one. So four terabyte, cost me about 80 quid, 75 quid, something like that. The only thing is it's Seagate. But anyway, let's see what it's like. Just a quickie this year. And there's the hard drive itself. Um, and that's going to have the power supply. Let's get it unwrapped. Well, there she blows. Get in focus. There she is. Plastic box. Got a couple of extra USB ports on the front. And what round of the back here? Power connector. And another USB connector connect it to your actual machine um, yeah let's get it connected up yeah you get all the connectors and everything there's your USB cable my game focus your USB cable power supply and you just fix on either the American Euro type plug connector or the included British type one right let's get it wired up okay she's firing up this little Seagate logo light comes on. Uh, anything on the Mac? Come on. Well, we've got Seagate backup plus drive. Get info. Four terabytes ready to go, baby. Okay, well, actually, it's um, I could view it, but it's formatted as NTFS, so I'm going to have to do it, set it up for Mac. So you'll have to do that if you've got a Mac, it's set up for NTFS. Well, it all seems to be working okay. That uh, my book over there is now connected to the front of the Seagate. And there they both are, look, there's the Seagate at the bottom and the My Book highlighted. Um, what I'm doing now is I'm copying from that Western Dig My Book to the Seagate. And they're both USB 3, this is fairly large size file. Here we go, bum. And, oh, yeah, it's quick. That was two gigabytes it just copied over there. Took about five seconds. Okay, um, so there you go. That is the Seagate Backup Hub. Um, and it's got the old uh, USB connectors on it. In fact, I've got that Western Digi connected to this now. I just copied from that to that, as you saw. They're both USB 3, fast as lightning. And you gain an extra USB port. Um, so I've got two external hard drives now plugged in, and I've still got a free USB port. Okay, hope that's useful. See you.